Dad, what's going on here? Where am I? Calm down, Lisa. You're in hospital. What? Why am I in hospital? I wanted to wake you yesterday. But you just didn't wake up. That's why we called an ambulance. And what do I have? The doctor said you had a lack of sleep. Have you had a lot of stress recently? Yes, I haven't been able to sleep for days. My poor child. When can I go home again? We need to talk to the doctor. Hello, doctor. Hello, Mr. Peters. Have you talked to Lisa yet? Yes, she's been awake for an hour. Very good. That is a good sign. Good morning, Lisa. How are you doing today? I'm a bit tired. Otherwise, I'm fine. Very nice. Are you in pain? No, I'm not in pain. Wonderful. Are you hungry yet? Yes, I'm really hungry. All right. We'll give you something to eat. You can go home after that. Lisa is already allowed to leave today. But she needs to recover. That means no television and no video games. Thank you, doctor. When will she be allowed to go back to school? She can go back to school tomorrow. As long as she's feeling good. Hello, darling. How are you feeling? Hi, mom. I'm doing fine. I'm just a little tired. Lisa must sleep now. So she can go to school tomorrow. Okay, I'm going to bed now. Lisa, you're already awake. How are you feeling? I feel great. I'm full of energy. Awesome. Then you can go back to school. Come on, let's go. Lisa, you're back. Are you okay? I heard you were in hospital. I was worried. Hey Sarah. It's all good. You have nothing to worry about. Perfect. Shall we go in? Yes, I'd love to. What is going on here? We were so worried about you, Lisa. 
We are very happy that you are back. Welcome back, Lisa. Thank you, guys. You really are the best. When can Lisa go back to school? A. Tomorrow. B. The day after tomorrow. C. In one week. <laughs>